most of you saw what I went through. Not once, not twice. I can't say I've been a victim, but I've been a consumer of what the police brutality is all about. But because I swore to my people that I will defend them, whatever the circumstances of Kilifi County, I will be prepared to pay the price. It is sad that I'm saying this, but I have to say it before my own colleagues that we play the ball. But this time I'm on this side, tomorrow I'll be on the other side. And the same will apply to all of us. We have seen it. The people we started with in the Senate, 2013, some of them in the ruling party or the majority party, today they're in parliament on the minority side. We have seen them in the National Assembly, and we have them also on the minority side. The Senate is a very, very important institution of parliament. We must defend the Senate at whatever cost. We must ask for respect from the law enforcement agents. You don't have to slap me. If you can slap a minority leader, if you can slap a senator, what you do will you do to a layman in the street? If you humiliate a national leader of my level, then what am I doing in the Senate? If you can make me sit on a cold floor, if you can make me go through, go through committee prisons, through a tunnel like a criminal, pass me through the tunnel of drug addict, drugs, peddlers internationally and local. If you can take me through such a terror situation and yet I'm a national leader, it pains me. It pains me so much simply because I'm defending my people.